Austin, Texas, the Frank Irwin Center. The site of our next 8-9 matchup in the Mercado region. You are watching the NCAA Women's Championship. It's the 8-seed South Florida Bulls taking on the 9-seed, the Washington State Cougars. Washington State with a historic season. It started the year 7-1, knocked off a pair of top 10 ranked teams, and because of that, entered the top 25 for the first time in school history. And just a couple days ago, celebrating not done yet making history this season. Washington State, of course, in the crimson. South Florida in the white. And the first three is down for Ioana Tadere. For South Florida to get here the way they did in the American tournament, playing and really winning with their defense, and obviously with Washington State, this entire season of first for them. That's one thing I even asked some coaches in the Pac-12 about this Washington State team. And they're like, this team takes on Cammie's demeanor. And you're seeing that just with the physical play of this team. Oh, Mara Catete with a nice block. Ledger Walker gets the roll. And that's the versatility of Charlize Ledger Walker. But you just got to tip your hat to all these freshmen and the impact they're having on the tournament this year. Trying to work free. Nan Curvis rolls and scores. Nicely done. The net ranking at 25, it's, it's not unreasonable to think, did they deserve maybe a higher seed? That three is down, and Washington State needed that one in a big way. And the second round to follow Tuesday and Wednesday. Oh, the block. Bella Murakatete has a couple early on for Washington State. You know, and what you have said about Clark is what we heard Cammie Etheridge say about this freshman right here. That's Charlie's Ledger Walker. That common denominator is just the mature demeanor and mental toughness that both she and Clark have in their first years. Definitely striking distance for Washington State. And now Murica Tete scores it this time. Mercatete open. There's the power dribble and score. Back to back buckets for the Rwandan. This is Crystal Ledger Walker. Corner pass to there for three. Great find. Again, Washington State now is the team that is reading what the defense is giving them and they're picking the Bulls apart. Six to shoot. Here's her sister, Crystal. Tadair, baseline jumper, falls through. Now 13 for the Estonian. Tedder's filling it for sure. Everything that she's putting up right now is getting that shooter's touch. A basket that Cougs alum Clay Thompson may appreciate. Watching his alma mater in action. A block by Murica Tete. And getting a high percentage second look. Eight points for Leverett. On the drive. The scoop. That's good. Ledger Walker. One of the six courts in five locations for the NCAA Women's Championship. Behind the back pass to Murakatete. Ledger Walker does it again. Harvey. Attacks, lost it. Ioana Tadair for three. When Washington State has needed a bucket this half, Tadair has stepped up and knocked it down. We're inside of two minutes. Each team with multiple timeouts remaining. Ledger Walker puts it in. One point lead, Washington State. Ice cold, this freshman is playing well beyond her age. Ledger Walker all over Chineke, jars it away, ball on the ground. Crystal Ledger Walker 
gets the timeout.